We at Environmental Health Trust are happy to help you protect your children and those you love. Uh, we provide you information about what you can do, how you can do it. We work with the American Academy of Pediatrics and pediatricians around this country to promote awareness of the fact that children are not little adults, that they should not be given cell phones like pacifiers, and that children need more lap time than app time. Please work with us. Please help us so we can help more of you to understand the importance of these precious years and limited time that you have with your children. Understand that we can help you if you provide a donation to us through our website at ehtrust.org or through our Patreon program. Thanks so much and best wishes from us to you for a happy holiday. Thank you. Did you know? That cell phone, the one in your pocket, emits radio frequency radiation. As long as your phone's turned on, even if you're not talking or texting. The American Academy of Pediatrics in over a dozen countries recommends reducing children's exposure to wireless radiation. When using a cell phone, I always keep it away from my body. I use speakerphone or a headset like this. To stop microwave exposure, I put my phone on airplane mode and turn off Wi-Fi and Bluetooth function. I hold the phone at a distance and make sure it's not touching my body. Cell phones are not toys. Children's brains and bodies are still developing and are vulnerable to wireless radiation. Practice safe and responsible habits with yourself and your children. When using the computer, I always try to make sure my connection is corded, not wireless. Remember not to use your cell phone in the car. The phone works at higher power in metal surroundings and bounces around, increasing your family's radiation exposure. For their safety. For your safety. Because children are more vulnerable. Remind them. Remind yourself. To limit your microwave radiation exposures.